Hey everyone, it's Nancy with She's Got Yarn. Welcome to the dog room. We're gonna, first off, I'm gonna share an ice yarn haul with y'all. Yeah, it's not a big haul, it's just a small one. I don't know why, but I'm having, you know how you crave ice cream? Well, I crave yarn. Like, I have this incredible craving for bright colors. I want to make a sweater. I want to make a white sweater with a lot of pinks in it. You name it. But anyways, I want to share some of my new yarn with you. I don't have a lot. This is my ice yarn order. <laughs> I can't remember what I ordered. I still don't really know. But I bought Saver 175 Neon Pink. And that's the number. You know, Krista with the Secret Yarnery, I love to watch her yarn hauls. But uh, I struggled. She didn't show the numbers. She put it on the screen, but I couldn't read it. The, le the writing's too small, so I'm kind of bummed out I couldn't. I probably would have ordered more. But yeah, she changed the way she shows what she's ordered, you know. But that's 78912. I wish she would have mentioned the numbers. I probably should email her and ask her, you know. But whatever. Yeah, the ice yarns, their print, their font isn't, like, it's not bold. Um, not the number of the yarn anyways. Oh, y'all, this is soft. I mean, it's really soft for acrylic. It's it's 100% acrylic. It's um it's a medium number 4. I can't see it, but I'm guessing <laughs> cuz I can't see it. This is their ball band. Can you see that? Is that terrible or what? can't read it. I couldn't read it if I had glasses on. But anyways, I bought a bunch of it. I spent about a hundred bucks. So, I didn't buy this to save money or anything. I bought it because I was looking for this color. Yep. If they had this in bulky, I would have bought it in bulky, but they didn't have it in bulky. So, but anyways, I got one, two, three, four, and five. So I got 10 skeins of this gorgeous neon pink. It's beautiful, acrylic neon pink. If they would have had orange, purple, green, I probably would have bought it also. But that's okay. I've got loops and threads neon colors. I've got Hershner's neon colors. But I wanted to see what Eyesharn had. And I bought the one color they had. Alright. Now this yarn. I love this yarn. I've had it before. I've used it all up. I've given it away. And I saw that it was back in stock. Some of it. So I bought some Picasso. Y'all, I this color I love. I have a darker, the darker one. I probably have three bags of. And then this one is number, there's not even a number on the bag. What's up with that? Maybe it's hot off the press. It goes so fast. They said they didn't need to put the numbers? I don't know. Let's see if I can find it. There's no number. It's just Picasso. And it's the acrylic and polyester. 44 acrylic, 56 polyester. There's 115 meters. So probably about 125, 130 yards. But isn't that pretty? I love those colors. They're so beautiful. I love them. And I have this in white. 
I don't know. My brain's thinking. But there's two, four, six, eight. So there's about probably a thousand meters in a bag, right? No. Wait. Eight, eight hundred meters, right? So probably, I don't know, maybe 800, maybe 900 yards in a bag, maybe. But I don't, I didn't need all this. I just wanted it. So I got one, two, I bought five, five times eight. I got 40 donuts. Yeah, what am I going to do with 40 donuts? I don't know. If I don't use them, they'll look beautiful on my shelf. Rainbow! But yeah, and then I have, I told you, I have the one that's a darker purple. I have it in the green room. So, this is my ice yarn haul. Okay. You still can't see it. Almost on the floor. I'm on the floor, but yeah, it's like a whole oh, this beautiful yarn. So I don't know. I've ordered. I've had some. Um, I've ordered some yarn from some uh, dyers, different dyers, and some won't be here till April. So I don't know. I was wanting to make something, but I may just use this yarn with white and just hold it together. Hold this together with a white, and I want to use this as the collars, the sleeve cuffs. I want to make a sweater. So I may just do that and use loops and thread acrylic and hold this with it periodically. I don't know if I want to do stripes. I don't know. So, anyway. But I do have one other small, tiny little haul. Some yarn that I bought. It's neon. Like I said, I'm craving this color. I'm craving it. This is even brighter. This is, I love this. But anyways, I bought this off Itchy Shop. And the shop, this is a thank you. Thank you for shopping with me. Happy Knitting, Kate. Her name is Kate. She has an Etsy shop. I'm going to share a photo of her shop. Well, all you got to do is type in You Knit Die. This is the name of her shop. She's very nice. Um, I think I paid like $22 a piece for these. They're... Um, Superwash Merino, extra fine chain construction. There's 109 yards, super bulky weight. Hand wash in cold water, lay flat to dry. So, so soft, so beautiful. But I got three of them. And I'll give you the specs so you can look at the specs. Because she has more. What does that say? Naive. Maybe that's the color name. But these are all the specs. Is that upside down? I can't see. And then this is the name of her shop. It's an Etsy shop. You knit dye. Yep. She has a lot of bulky yarn. And... A lot of, I mean, this hand-dyed yarn, this special yarn is expensive. You know, any, it runs anywhere from 22 to 30. I've seen some as high as $32, maybe more. I don't know if her shop went over 32 but there were some shops that were like 37 for 100 yards. I just, you know, I'm not that good <laughs> by that kind of, I don't know. I just didn't want to spend that kind of money. So, but... This is what I got, and I got more to come. I'm excited. So, 
I'm gonna end that. That is my yarn haul. My small little ice yarn haul and my You Knit It Itsy shop. I wanna start buying from Itsy to support our community. I mean, that's probably where our future will lie is in online only because these big, I don't know what's gonna happen to these big box stores, you know? Just don't know. I hear summer closing and opening bigger, a bigger and better Joann's. I don't know. It really makes me sad because Joann's is my only local yarn shop. Michael's here. They did get the new yarns in. The only yarn they didn't get in was the Karen Coconut, I think. It took them a while. I don't even know if they have them now. But a lot of that I bought online or I went to Ocala and shopped with Nina's Knots Crochet, Lenann. We went shopping and had a great time. But yeah, our, my Michaels is really sad for most of, most of the time. The yarn, you know, their their yarn, like their loops and thread is wiped out. Their shelves are always empty. Um, I mean, every now and then they stock up, but once it's gone, it takes a long time for them to restock. So, I don't know, but they do, I haven't been in a couple weeks, but a couple week, weekends ago, I went in there and... Um, I bought some of the the cakes that Karen, the new cakes, the cinnamon cakes and the the other new one. I can't think of the name off the top of my head. I shared it with you guys and I gave some away and a giveaway. Um, but yeah, that's about it. Um, did I share with you? I'm yeah, I did. I bought this. At Hobby Lobby in Tennessee. I've never seen this color before. I thought it was absolutely gorgeous. It's cotton. It's it's sugar wheel cotton sparkle. Let it go flamingo. $7.49. Yeah. 296 yards. And that's where these prices hurt them because we will go online and shop before we pay eight bucks for for you know. 300 yards of cotton when you can go online and get it cheaper and you can you know so I don't know where yarn bee gets their yarn from but I you know I don't know if they get it for I have I don't know I don't think I've ever seen a yarn bee yarn at like ice yarns you know sometimes we can find yarns like this from ice and you'll go, that's a puzzle yarn. It's just a different label. But I don't think I've ever, not, I've seen similar, but I don't think I've ever seen the Sugar Wheel cotton sparkle. I mean, I may be wrong. That website is very difficult to maneuver. I love ice yarns, but I don't like their website <laughs> at all. It's just difficult to shop on and now they're not putting numbers on their bags that's messed up are they doing it because they don't want it to be wiped out because I show it <laughs> but you know what I can look it up let's look it up um, if my internet's behaving my internet wasn't behaving a little bit ago Ice yarns, it's right there. Yeah. All right. They sell ice yarns everywhere now. I go straight to their um, their page. Pico. They didn't even spell Picasso right. It's Picoso. P. -ca Picasso. Picasso. It's not even pulling up. It's not even pulling up. 
Isn't that interesting? Yeah, it's not pulling up. And they didn't give me the number. I know it's not sold out. All right, so let's see. Nancy has to log into her account. Nancy. Transaction, oh, my orders, my orders. Okay, my most recent order was four days ago. I spent $114. And the number six four six two six, and then also the saver is seven eight nine one two. Can y'all see that? Hmm. Hold on. That's aggravating. You can see it now. So, that's the Picasso I bought. But these colors are beautiful, but they have nothing else. 175. Let's see. 78912. 78912. Let me try that. 78912. Search. Yeah. These were the only colors they had. It's the only bright color they had. So, if you don't know the number, it's hard. Let's type in favorite. Favorite. There's so many different favorites. Oh, my goodness. Yeah. There's favorite, and they've got so many colors. There's a pretty color. But I'm going to type in neon and see what comes up. I'm so bummed that Krista didn't say the numbers. Did anybody else say something to her? I didn't say anything. Yeah, the only neon color they have is DK. They have some macrame. There's the color I bought. 175. They got 150 neon. Oh, they got more. I didn't see those. They got more. They don't have purple. They don't have blue. Like, I would love to get a blue like that solid, you know? That would be so pretty. And a purple and a favorite yarn, you know? What is that? That is wool, 25% wool, 25 premium acrylic. It is called Fantasia. Now, I've owned this Fantasia. It's a roving yarn. It's choppy. Like, I tried to make a hat and the the colors like just a sharp cut and it goes to another color so it's pretty in the scheme but yeah i actually i gave it away i gave it away to a friend but yeah i mean it's beautiful yarn but i didn't like the way it's striped how the colors they didn't ombre at all Yep. Here's a sale winter. They're all cream. Yeah, you gotta pay attention when they when they like. I don't know what time of the year that they like renew stuff, but yeah, I I didn't pay any attention this year. Not at all. But Michaels had some beautiful neon colors, and so did Hershner's this year. Um. And I think Joanne had some nice, nice um, new yarn ombre. I've got like 
Jennifer at Cinnamon Stitches gave me some ombre, orange, yellow. It's really pretty yarn. And somebody else was working with pinks or lavenders. It was beautiful. They're ombre. I think it's called ombre. It may be called variegated. I'm not sure, y'all. But it is beautiful yarn. Yeah, so. But. Well, listen, I'm going to end this video here because I'm going out of town and I want to make a bagging video so you guys have something to watch while I'm gone. And then hopefully I'll do a video of Tansy time. And my mom is coming. We're going, I don't know if you, I don't know if I told you guys. I'm going to, I'm going to probably repeat myself and I apologize, but I am going to Orlando this weekend. I am spending it with my daughter and my mom. Um, Tiffany has a couple stained glass lamps that she's purchased. We got to pick up. She doesn't want to take the risk of shipping them because they're one of a kind. And then we're also going to um, stained glass shop. We're going to be there two days. So one day we're going to do the stained glass thing, a little bit of yarn shopping. I'm going to try to find some local yarn shops in Buena Vista, Orlando area. And then um, I want to stop by the Michaels that, that Juan went to by the airport. And then the next day, we're going to hit the outlet mall. I might hit Vera Bradley, you know, because every year, well, what time of the year are we in? Right now it's just March. But every, like, August or September, around that time, there's the Builders Convention. And this year, we're officially, both of us are retired. So, we probably won't go to the Builders Convention. We'll probably send some of our employees. Like Tyler, he's the new president of the company, so he'll probably go. And probably send a couple of his salesmen. And so, we won't need to go. So, maybe I'll hit the outlets and hit Vera Bradley. Because I want to do that like I've done every year. I give a bag, a Vera Bradley bag away, and the person who wins picks somebody else to win a Vera Bradley bag. And preferably somebody in our yarn community, um, you know, but that's okay. I mean, it is what it is. Um, you can give it to a sister, but usually somebody will give it to somebody in our yarn community, which is kind of cool. So, yeah. But it doesn't matter who you give it to. The first one's going to somebody from my yarn community anyways, right? So, but I'm so happy I got this because it's been gone. Now, there's another color I want that was get notified. But you know what? They didn't notify me. But then again, I'm really bad about checking my emails. I am guilty as charged. I hate... I don't know. My phone is like... I have 50 texts by the time I wake up on my phone, 50. And a lot of it's junk, and it's just like, I don't even wanna look at my phone. <laughs> it was a business phone, so, but yeah. I'm, I'm, and then, you know, I have like 900 emails. And people get upset with me because I don't get my emails. It's because there's so damn many of them. So I opened it, She's Got Yarn. Nobody, ha not many people have that except y'all. So, and I'm bad about reading that one too. You know, I'm bad about getting on the computer. So, but I try. So, I don't know if it's, I don't think it's I'm lazy. I just, I don't know why I, why I don't want to check anything. It's just, I just want to lay here and sit here and crochet and nobody bother me. <laughs> Isn't that terrible? I know I'm not alone. I know I'm not alone. It's just like, let me get a couple more rows in, okay? And I'll go check it. But I do check it, but not as often as I should. I am guilty. I am going to, in my next video, bag up a bunch of goodies. Yeah, yep. I'm gonna bag them while I can. So, all right, I hope you enjoyed the video. I will see you tomorrow. I love y'all. And definitely we'll share Orlando. I told Tiffany we had to vlog. Well, I have that new thing that I hang around my neck. Y'all want to see it? I'll show you. I'll show you how it works. It's really cool. 
I got it on Amazon. And like when I was in the yarn shops the other day, I might have shared this with you. I don't know. I was in the yarn shop the other day when I was in Gatlinburg. And, and see, I have a magnet in my phone case. If you don't, it comes with a ring. I have a ring that you can put in your case, but this works fine. And I can record you guys or better yet no let me try this the other way I just want you to see what goes on let's see see I can video did I scare you Archie Can you see yourself? <laughs> but yeah, so I walked around the store, kind of had it tilted, but what I did was I turned it around. So I was able to see what it was looking at. You know, let's see. No. Yeah, see, I can see the yarn. So I could kind of glance down and see what it's looking at. But it's so nice. I can like just hold the yarn. I love it. I went in every yarn store. I didn't turn it on all the time. But some people were looking at me like, what does she got going on? But this thing is awesome. And it's, it bends. So you take your phone off. Like you can adjust your phone. Then it has like a little... You put your phone up out of the way, but to take it off, you push your button and the button's on the opposite side where it disconnects. But yeah, it's, I love it. And it wasn't that much. I think I paid like 20 bucks for it on Amazon. Let's see. Me. Quarters. Let's see. My shop uses my Amazon. Here it is. It's called a Qwis K E W E I S Qwis magnetic neck phone holder. And to buy it again, it would cost me. It's twenty six dollars and ninety cents right now. I can get it for twenty three percent off. Right? No, that is with the 23% off. Let me, let me double check. Yeah, that's with 30% off. So, yeah, $26. I don't think I paid that much. I think I paid like 20 with a coupon. But I may be wrong. But yeah, I, I mean, if you're a vlogger, if you're doing what I'm doing, great investment especially if you're out and about so and yeah that's about it so I'm gonna end it here you guys have a good day this is my second goodbye I love you <laughs>